Welcome to The Crafty Chemist. Today I will be doing a walkthrough of the 2021-2022 Close to My Heart Core Catalog. If you like anything you see, you can go to my website at thecraftychemist.closetomyheart.com. This page talks about how you can become a maker with Close to My Heart or a VIP with Close to My Heart that has special savings. We have some starter kits to get you started if you're new into scrapbooking or stamping. We have a subscription program called Craft with Heart and there is a scrapbooking program and a card making program. We also have wonderful love of color books that help you put together colors that will work together. There's the Love of Color Volume 2 and the Love of Color Volume 1. You can see that it gives you ideas for a five color layout or a three color layout. We also have idea books that give you sketches where it helps you make layouts and there are samples given. Melissa Esplin has a program for brush lettering or penmanship if you want to increase your writing capabilities. The first paper collection in this catalog is called As You Grow, and it is our baby-themed paper collection. However, you will see that the papers can be used for many more themes than just baby. Look at the beautiful paper collection. In this As You Grow paper collection, you get 12 sheets, two each of the six double-sided designs. You can get this with or without the sticker sheet. Here is an example of five of the papers. I used the other paper on my layouts, but I will point them out later. There's a nice gingham plaid. This paper is has flowers and butterflies. And on this side, there are uh, mushrooms and a cricket. This is a beautiful harbor colored background with flowers and a wood grain paper. You can see that it's themed for either a boy or a girl. You can get um, the sticker sheet with a paper pack if you choose. I used a lot of the stickers um, on the layouts, but you'll see them later. Our stickers are very sturdy. Close to my heart always has a coordinating cardstock pack that goes with the collection, so they curate colors specifically for you. It makes it really easy to match the printed paper. And here I'm showing you a sample of all of the colors that are in the coordinating cardstock. You get 12 sheets to each of these colors. And the colors are shortbread, papaya, mulberry, glacier, harbor, and New England ivy. We have special Picture My Life cards that coordinate with the paper and stickers. In the Picture My Life set, you get 24 double-sided cards, 12 each of 4x6 or 3x4. They are two-sided, and I'm just showing you an example of a couple. Now I will show you some samples that I made with the papers so you can see how they look. I love this first layout because it gives you a good idea about all of the different papers. It really highlights the papers. Look at the strips down the, the side of the page. But you can see that that ne doesn't necessarily have to be baby. Here's another one that um, uses the short bread. And I also used that paper that um, I was not able to show you in uh, when I showed the paper collection. You can see the little ferns on it. This layout, I made uh, a more masculine sort of theme with the harbor, the dark blues, and the glacier. And it has um, some snails and uh, the turtles and those mushrooms down at the bottom. Aren't they cute? So again, baby, but also, you know, little kid. And then I really like this layout with that cute little fox. 
Now let's look at the next paper collection. It is called Smarty Pants, and this is our school-themed paper. Look how fun and bright that is. I love the colors in this collection. Let's take a look at the papers. Again, in this collection, you get 12 sheets, two each of six double-sided designs, and then you can get the coordinating sticker sheet if you choose. There's also a set of Picture My Life cards in the coordinating card stock. Let's take a look at the papers up close. This one is a pink on one side and a stripes on the other. This is a really fun paper um, that highlights teachers. And on the back side is a grid. The third paper has science um, de designs on one side and then the um, composition notebook black you know marble pattern. This page has some cute uh, tennis shoes and on the other side sort of typewritten letters. This page has you know that um, writing paper from when you're little and on the other side is paper airplanes. And the last paper on one side is a cork board design and then black stars on the other. All of our paper is two-sided. Here's a close-up of the sticker sheet. Look how fun and bright that is. A lot of school designs, a globe, um, books, and then I really love these little definitions at the bottom, really cute embellishments. And I also love that ruler sticker. This is the coordinating cardstock. Again, you get 12 sheets, two each of white daisy, black, sapphire, lemonade, nectarine, and a new color, capri. Look how amazing those colors are together. I don't have a sample of the Picture My Life cards, but you can see them there. Um, there are 24 double-sided pocket cards, 12 of the 4x6 and 12 of the 3x4. Here I made a layout using the Smarty Pants, and this is a layout where um, you can put the school picture from each year of school, like kindergarten, first grade, second grade, third grade. Isn't that cute? Okay, the next paper collection is called Love Story, and this is a very special collection. This is our wedding themed paper, and the paper is all neutrals. There's blacks, there's toffees, and there is minks. And this allows you to mix in the colors from the wedding that you are scrapbooking. So let's look at the black collection. Look at that sticker sheet. The bottom is gold foil and there are uh, six sheets two each of three double-sided designs and then you can choose the coordinating sticker sheet if you want to so let's take a closer look at the papers again this is three two-sided designs so there's six different designs I love this paper there's a floral a sort of I would say floral too, a little dotted floral this one is just a, a diamond pattern this one is a stripes this has um, little dots on it and then another floral again the paper is two-sided now let's take a look at the love story mink collection so these are the grays and the paper pa sticker sheet here is really pretty it has silver foil on the bottom of the stickers. You can see the foiling on up there. So about half of the stickers are foiled. Let's take a closer look at the papers. Again, there's six, three two-sided designs. I love that floral. There's like a mandala 
There's the uh, diamonds. That's the floral. That's the mandala. I kind of diamonds there. This one is a little um, floral design, I'll say, stripes. And this one is diamonds. You can tell that the um, designs on the paper packs do vary. And the last of the love story paper is a toffee pack. Now this one, it's not foiled, but some of the stickers have a UV coating that make them um, shine. So a little um, shimmer, not shimmer, but a little shine to them. Here's the paper. Again, six sheets, two each of three double-sided designs. And you have the mandala paper. This is a nice floral design, some dots. These ones are diagonal stripes. This one is, I guess, a floral and then the diamonds. And remember, our paper is two-sided. There are two packs of Picture My Life cards, a gold pack and a silver pack. In each pack, you get 12 of the um, Picture My Life cards. Here's a sample that I made um, for my daughter's wedding. I used the toffee paper. And then I embellished or used the colors from her wedding as a decorative note. So the New England Ivy and the paprika there. So it coordinates very well with that toffee paper. Okay, we have other smaller packs. This is the wood grain pack. You get six sheets, two each of the three double-sided designs. And then a textures pack six sheets to each of the three double-sided designs. And there's like a denim, a brick, a jute. This collection is called Noteworthy. You get six sheets, one each of six double-sided designs. And notice that one of them the one side is white and then the other side is sort of antiqued. And then we have the rose gold paper. This is gold foiled. So here you get six sheets, one each of six single sided designs. So these are only single sided. I love this gold foiling on them. It's a rose gold. Look at those flowers and leaves. And this plaid paper is really amazing. Again, it's single-sided. Now let's get into some of our stamp sets that will be available all year long. This first one is called In a Book Stamp, and you can get this with or without the thin cuts. On this page, we have two different designs. We have the family circus, the one with the tent, and then one that says, love you most, the family set. And on the other side is uh, the love story scrapbooking stamp. This set is love story card making stamp on the left, and on the right is the heartfelt wreath stamp. It has some beautiful wreath and, and nice sentiments like sympathy and thinking of you. I really love this next set. It's called the Rustic Design, Rustic Sign Sentiment Stamp. And then um, there's the As You Grow stamp set and that goes with the Baby As You Grow paper collection. So take a look at that. You can use these with that paper collection I showed at the beginning. This is called Festive Border Stamp, and again, you can get it with or without the thin cuts. And on the right is a really amazing gnome birthday set. It's called Party Gnome Stamp and Thin Cuts, or you can get it just the stamps. Everybody is loving the gnomes. If you want these, I would get them as soon as possible. This 
this set um, is called Happy Cake Day Stamp and Thin Cuts, or you can get it without the thin cuts. It works great on those slimline cards. And then the Ooh La La Macarons stamp set. I have this one and it is so cute. This also looks great on the slimline. Here I use the Life is Sweeter with Friends and Macarons stamp and the Macarons stamp itself to make this cute slimline, but you can use it on a regular A2 size cards like this one. And I use the color of the year, which I'll be talking about later. Here's another one with uh, Wildberry and the Capri paper. And I colored those stamps in with um, the water paints. Introducing the new buddy stamp. Last year we had the besties, the girl stamps. This year we're having the uh, buddies boy stamp. There is Joey with his sports. There's Ian with his electronics. Isaac with his puppy. And Ezra with his skateboard and snack foods. So cute. I love that dog stamp. And they brought back the besties stamp sets. These are the girl stamps. So Zoe has got a, the cat. Olivia has the puppy. Lucy has the balloon and Kelsey has got a flower pot. I do have these from last year and I love them. Two of them do look like my daughters um, so I made sure to get these. Although on the one set um, I accidentally ordered the set without the thin cuts, but that's okay. Here's a couple samples that I made using these um, stamps. The next stamp set is called Smarty Pants Stamps, and this goes with the school paper pack, the Smarty Pants pack. I do have this one, and I'll show you the stamps just so you can get an idea of the size. But these go perfectly with that school paper pack. You could also use the stamp set on the right called date stamp. This comes with or without the thin cuts and it makes those like library book checkout cards. This stamp I think is a must have for everybody. It's called for all occasions. It does not come with a thin cut set but it has every occasion that you will need. So this is a great one to have as just a basics. On the right is called Perfectly Imperfect Patterns. And these are nice for, to make background stamps, um, you know, background letters, that sort of thing. And then we have some um, embroidery stamps. We have the embroidery borders on the left, the embroidered circles, and then the embroidered card front set. All of those look like they've been embroidered or made with the sewing machine. This is a fun set. It's um, called the Map Your Journey, and it includes all of the countries that um, and the markets that we are in. So it includes Canada, Australia, Japan, New Zealand, and the United States. And these are fairly big stamps. You can see that stamp across um, the 12 by 12 page. These are our new alphabet stamps. We have Prairie, Shoe, Daisy, Bold, Celebration, Cassidy, Arizona, Alpha Doodle, Stitched Alphabet, and Pattern Block. The Celebration and Stitch Alphabet are two layered stamps. Okay, here are some more of the Melissa Esplin um, lettering training course. And then these are the Story by Stacy um, directions or workshop where it shows you how to write beautiful stories to go along with your pictures. Now let's look all at all of our new thin cuts. We have thin cuts new uh, floral thin cuts and a cupcake uh, thin cut, a purse thin cut, a backpack thin cut, and we also have um, a thin cut that makes the little tabs for your gift cards. 
They brought back the waterfall thin cut to make waterfall cards and the card front spinner thin cuts. There's a new uh, tag set where you can make, um, you can build different tags. And then there's also the tabs, uh, tags and tabs thin cuts. I have the tabs one here. And so this is cute to put on the bottom of pictures or uh, pull out things. Okay, so here is the, the new flower set, layered flowers. And then they brought back the small bow thin cuts. We have a new collection of uh, slimline card thin cuts. You can see there, there's a circle windows, the square windows, the shaker windows. Um, you can also get the shaker window foam and acetate. We have some new card front A2 shaker frames. There's the rectangle frame and the curved uh, oval frame, and you can get the corresponding foam and acetate with those. Again, the stars and the circle shaker windows. I do have the new circle ones here. It has um, these thin cuts that cut out actual little shaker pieces to put in your cards. We also have a heart, a square, and a rectangle um, thin cuts that make shakers in those shapes. We have a new slimline alphabet thin cuts and the classic thin cuts. There are some new word thin cuts that you can cut out these words at just because, sending hugs, congrats, love you. Um, and then there's the stitch fancy brackets. There's a new um, embossing folder called Botanicals, really pretty flowers. And you can see that that center white part is the embossed part. And then we have circles dies that you can cut out different shape circles. Now let's look at some of our specialty paper. Let's look at the glitter paper. Isn't this beautiful? The new ones are papaya, mulberry, wildberry, capri, harbor, and mocha. I have some of the glitter paper, but none of the new ones. So I'll show you the ones that I do have. I have evergreen, scarlet, gold, silver, rose gold, and white. And what's great about our glitter paper is it does not shed glitter. You can scratch on it and no glitter comes off. So it's really great to use and it's not messy. We also have some uh, iridescent, it's called holographic paper. Um, I have the Sunbeam and the Twinkle Toes. You can get a glitter paper bundle where all of the glitter paper comes with it. Here's our specialty paper. We have craft paper, vellum, distressed watercolor, which I do have a sample of that. This is great when you're using the water paints or uh, the, the watercolor pencils. We also have tracing paper. And then you can get bulk packs of the white A2 cards and also the slimline cards. And if you want to make a calendar, especially as a gift for the holidays coming up, that um, we have those too. We have the smaller perpetual calendar and then the larger base calendar. Now let's start looking at the embellishments. There are some new embellishments. Our shimmer trims are very popular. The new ones this year are candy apple, papaya, wild berry, capri, clover, and rose gold. Very beautiful. These are self-adhesive. We have the new wild berry um, loose sequins, and I'll show you them there. Aren't they beautiful? This is the color of the year, and I will talk about that in a little bit. Let me shake some out so you can see the different textures and colors. We have other new embellishments, um, some loose gems. Those are, they're like little teeny gemstones. There's um, new pink mini hearts 
and mini circles. And we have a new collection of the acrylic shapes. The good thing about the acrylic shapes is they have made these half as thick as they were before. Now they are only 1 8 inch thick and I will show you a comparison. But all of our acrylic shapes come in black, white, or wood. So they're only showing the black in the catalog, but you can get all of those in white or wood. And here I'm trying to show you a close up of how the thickness compares to what it was before. If you did not like the acrylic shapes before because you thought it made your pages too bulky or it made your cards impossible to send through the mail, I recommend trying these out because um, they are much thinner and will work a lot better for you. So take a chance on these. Here we have our watercolor paints, our watercolor pencils, and the water brushes. I recommend these as really basic elements that you need. We have some embossing powder and all of the accessories to go with that. I really love our markers. These are our tri-blend markers. So each pen has three different colors on them, a light, a medium, and a dark. We have two bundles that you can get, um, the essentials and the deep blends. And there's also metallic. A new thing that's really great in this catalog is now we have journaling pens in a lot of different colors. And we also have new white gel pens. Look at all of the shimmer brushes that we have. So these are brushes that have colors. Um, they're like markers, but they have shimmer to them. So we have new papaya, wild berry, mulberry, capri, harbor, short, uh, rosemary, shortbread, and mocha. So these are great for to make accents. They brought back our glitter glues and we also have the liquid pearls. We're still carrying the Distress Oxide. There are two new ones. Um, one of the new ones is called Mermaid Lagoon and the other is Vintage Photo. Here's the new Mermaid Lagoon. There's also two new of the gloss sprays. There is the white and the, it's called, um, I don't know if it has a name. Oh, it's gilt, so it's like gold. Okay, we have new stencils that are card front size. So these ones are um, five inches by six and a half, so the smaller size. And then we are carrying new 12 by 12 stencils. And you can get these in uh, stencil packs. So that's one, two, and three stencil packs. These are great to use with the texture paste. We're carrying two new stamping blocks, a one by one and a half, and a new four by four. Here's um, our cutting elements, um, and we have a new magnetic plate. I really love this. You can see, um, here's my magnetic plate. I've used it already. This is really great to line up your dies on a stamped image, and then they stick to that, and it, they don't move when you run it through your machine. My favorite thing is this new pickup tool that helps you pick up gems. We also have a new dual tip um, paper crafting tool. And now you can get the new die cutting system in the catalog. It used to be available in just the Reward Your Way catalog, but now it's in the main catalog. We have some new um, adhesive runner, the new Air Touch Adhesive by Tombow. And you can get um, the refills. I'm really excited about this new uh, quickie glue pen for those times when you need really a small amount of glue if you're trying to put down an intricate uh, thin cut. I think that's perfect. I'm also excited about this adhesive tape. This is a little bit stronger than the adhesive tape runners. So if you want to do something that's a little more, that needs a little more security from the tape, um, 
this works perfectly. So if you're making like little books or something that's going to be opened and closed a lot, um, I really recommend this. And you can see here, it's like a, I think it's a quarter inch. And my absolute favorite thing are these new adhesive sheets. So this, you can, you can put paper on it, stick it down, run it through your die cutting machine, and now it's a sticker. This is our Workspace Wonders collection to help you organize. And we have a new, uh, new organizer. It is the 6x8 storage envelopes. This is our digital collection. So these are digital images that you can download and then upload to uh, whatever program you're using, like Design Space. You can also get the bundle. Here are our albums. Um, we have spine extenders, album posts, and uh, label holders. Here's the different um, everyday albums, everyday life albums. We have some 12 by 12, eight and a half by 11, six by eight and six by six in different colors. And we have the story by Stacy six by six and also the four by four albums. These um, are made by story by Stacy. We have our pocket pages, our page protectors, um, that have different shapes. And then we also hear our, our flip flaps. Close to my heart is known for their flip flaps that help you extend the number of pictures on a page. Now introducing the color of the year, Wildberry. Isn't it beautiful? I would call it like a fuchsia color. Um, it's more purple than say a raspberry. Here's a sample of the paper. Gives you a good idea about what color it is. Again, it's two shaded, um, a dark side and a light side. But there are other things in this collection. There's the Wildberry ribbon, the shimmer trim, the glitter gems, the sequins, the ink, and the shimmer brush, along with the paper. This is a picture of all of the paper colors that we carry. I will point out the new colors. The new colors this year are papaya, mulberry, capri. Oh, there's papaya. I'm showing you a sample. This mulberry. This is capri. I really love capri. Okay, Harbor. This is a dark blue. Um, it looks very, it's very dark blue, almost black, but it is blue. There's Rosemary, very pretty color Rosemary. Shortbread, I love this, and it actually does look like shortbread cookies. There's mocha, which is a really beautiful brown. I'm glad they brought this color out because really there wasn't a good brown. And then the color of the year, Wildberry. So let's look at a close up of all of these. They come in the paper, inks, and you can also get the re-inker. What's nice about our paper is, as I said before, it is two-sided. There is a dark side, which is the true color side, and then the lighter side. We're also now carrying black paper with a black core. All of our paper has a white core, except that black paper with a black core. You can get a custom pack. You can either make a 12-sheet pack or a 24-sheet pack, where you can include two of, up. Uh, two sheets um, of different colors, of like six different colors in the 12 pack or 12 different colors in the 24 pack. Here I'm going to compare the new colors to old ones. This is Papaya and Smoothie, Smoothie Retired. Papaya was on the left. Here is Mulberry and I'm going to compare it to Lilac which was retired.
Here is the Capri, and this is Carolina Lagoon and Glacier. So just to show you how they compare to each other. They all have their place. Let's look at Harbor. Here's Harbor. And I'm comparing it to Peacock, which they did retire. You can see that just, this is a much darker blue. Again, it almost looks black, but it is blue. It's not a navy. Here's Rosemary. And I'll compare it to a couple greens. That's Sage. And this is New England Ivy. Just to get a sense about how they compare. And then let's look at the color of the year. Here we have the wild berry, and let's compare it to raspberry. You can see it's a much more purple color than the raspberry. And there you have it, a walkthrough of the core catalog. If you would like to purchase anything, go to my website, thecraftychemist.closetomyheart.com. If you would like to place an order, there's my website. I also have a Facebook page, Facebook group, and Instagram.